I uh, today I was on my way into the office and this week I'd been trying to think of devotionals and they just weren't coming to mind and so it got to be Wednesday and I hadn't thought of it so on the way in the office I don't know about you but sometimes on my way somewhere I picture where I'm going and as I did I thought of this little globe that I have in my office it's a metal globe it's an old-fashioned one might be an antique it was given by some place called World Savings. And it was thinking about this that I would see when I got to my office that gave me my devotional inspiration today. You see, it's also a bank. And the words that came to my mind as I thought about this were these. Invest in the world. And it sounds funny. I know it sounds cheesy maybe or whatever. But I think it's a good thought that as believers, we need to invest in our world. And you may say, well, our world is going to be a ball of fire, and we're not going to be here, and why should we invest in it? Well, first off, we have to remember that Jesus loves the world. Remember, God so loved the world. Now, it isn't the globe, and it isn't the physical world that we're talking about, but the people of the world. And when we invest in the world, I think what we do is we invest in in bringing as much of the world to God as we can. And we do that by praying for our world. We pray for the lost of our world. We pray for the lost of our nation and our state and our, our local city and communities. And they're lost, aren't they? Many of them, a lot of the world. We pray for missions and invest in missions. You know me, I think everyone should be involved in missions in one of three, of two ways. You either go and show, so you go and be a missionary, or you stay and pay so others can go. And so I think that one of the best ways we invest in the world is to invest in missions and give to reach the world. Give regularly. We're going to have missionaries at our church the next couple Sundays because they're in the area to go to the conference. It's a great time to start giving regularly to missions and invest in our world. And you know what? We're going to this conference this week I just mentioned, and we're investing our work and our time in preparing God's people to go and reach the world. Let's invest in our world. Let's pray for it. Let's give for missions. Let's reach our neighbors. They're part of this lost world. Let's invest in the world with our money, with our time, and with our talents. So God's kingdom goes as far as possible around the world. He so loved. Thank you, Lord, that you so loved the world, that you gave your son, and that we were those that were one because of it. And you changed our lives. Thank you for that. Help us, Lord, to help your world, your kingdom advance and invest in the world so you will have them all as part of your kingdom forever. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless.